It's a Wednesday, and it's a new day, because I sure hope so, because last night didn't have my best night. I played all the machines that I typically went on, and hey, I came out there. Had a little bit of win on a few machines, and boom, I hit rock bottom. Not rock bottom, because I don't gamble with money that I can't afford to lose, but boy, I lost my allocation for last night. So, I'm gonna do something different. I'm on the main floor, at the Seminole Hard Rock in Tampa, Florida. It's early, it's about 7.30 in the morning. It still has a lot of music on here, but it's a lot quieter than what it is during the evening. And so I figure today, or at least for now, I'm gonna try playing machines that, well, recently haven't been treating me so well to hope that they will start treating me well. So I'm right here at Huff and even more Puff. I have, and let me fix this. That's what happens at Session Abandoned when you have your card in too long, and I did it while I was setting up. Okay, $1,000 in the machine, $6 per spin. Let's close that window, and you, as you know. Oh, let me see how we doing on the volume. It's all the way up. We need three buzzsaws, six hats. The wolves are wild. The name of the game here is to get into a bonus round or get some really good line pays that have, you know, full screens of piggies and to get as many hats in there so you can start with some straw huts there's some brick shacks, brick shacks, is that a good one? All the way up to gold mansions. And then when it comes to pay off, well, the mansions are how you get the big money. So here, uh, you know, it's funny, and it's based on a poll that I had on my The Gadget Guru YouTube channel that well, I was asking viewers which slot rounds they like watching the most. And I'm trying to say this off the top of my head. I'm, Oh, that somebody just came up and just said she watches me all the time. How are you today? Do you think I'm going to win on this one? Okay, well, give me some good luck here. Okay, that was a really nice lady. He said she watches us all the time. Our subscribers are the nicest people on the planet today. Okay, now I forgot what I was saying. Okay, anyway, we want to get into the bonus rounds here. Uh, oh, and I was talking about the survey. Uh oh, I almost had a presidential moment here. And I kind of lost my train of thought. Where the majority of people, I want to say it was, was it 57% said they prefer watching slot rounds. And I had like 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 100 plus. The majority said $5 rounds. So this is $6 round because that's really the only way that I could get this. This is the lowest denomination on this 10 cent machine. So can we win on low denomination? And can we get one of those really surprise wins? Now remember on this one, Okay, those are the lazy piggies there for nine dollars. Now the line pays aren't as good on this version. Really do need to get in the bonuses, but as I was saying on this version, if you get the bus sauce and the first two are yellow and the third is gold, you get to go up to the second wheel, which is the super wheel. Super wheel! You get the super mansion, super bus sauce. You know, let's just hope we don't get a, a mini. Uh, you can also get on here some random bonuses. One is a tail, the wolf's tail that goes in boss, and the other is a howling wolf. Either way throws you into a bonus round. I don't know if one's better than another. Let's, I guess we'll find out. But we're 180 in this machine so far, and so far, nada. That means nothing. Okay. That was a lot to get out up front. I think this theory about going to machines, since the machines that usually pay me didn't pay me, or pay me well, the, you know, to go to machines that typically don't pay me to see if we can have this bizarro world here. We can turn things around. Remember Superman Bizarro? And then Seinfeld did a Bizarro episode since he's such a Superman friend. That was fun. Okay, now we have full screen of Lakey Pickies. That's the lowest level of the picky sector. And this is going to be $108. But you know, we haven't had too much going on here so far. I haven't been recording for too, too long. Just a few minutes. And this is going to be $108. Let's just enjoy the good times. Okay, we're about 100, just under 140 down at the moment. Okay, it's just a bit of ammo. You know, I wish I could have a floor, but I have a ceiling here. You know, since it's just a $6 bet, if we can end up... Oh, God, one more! Uh, end up at $1,500, I'll be just tickled pink. 
Tickle pig. How's that? Tickle pig. Pink pig. One more. Five a lot. Okay, Vegas man, I'll give you credit for that same statement, even though we saw them all for decades. You know, I think last night I was talking, I wonder when it started, when, I wonder who the first slot manufacturer was, when we went to the video game era, you know, the screen era away from the real, who came up with, hey, here's how we're going to do this. We're going to have two sets of symbols. Oh, those are the executive biggies. We needed more. And we're going to have two sets of symbols. And, you know, we're going to have to have three of one and six of another. Here, whether it's hats on Dragon Link or balls, and you know, here you have buzz saws, the others you might have flags or pots. You know, it's pretty much the same. And we, I was having this conversation with uh, one of our viewers online just recently. And we were talking about the reason, because I think I made a comment about a four. He commented, made a comment on my comment. That's called the conversation. And that, you know, between Huff, the Huff and Puff series and the Dragon Link series. One reason they're so popular is that they're easy to understand. I just wish it would pay more and pay more frequently. Okay, we got a lot in here. When I say at six, at six dollars per spin, you know, we've gone through, oh, almost three hundred dollars here. When I say that, that's we put we put more in it than that, but that's where we are balance wise. Okay. You know, it's not easy getting up like at 6 a.m. You know, I'm retired, but it sure is nice that after you get up and get, take a shower, get woken up, a hip of coffee, come down. You know, it's much quieter down here than it is during the, uh, during the evenings or even, you know, peak day. Now, you know, I, when I record a video, you know, when I come out here, I come up about every two weeks or so. And I try to record 10, 12, 15 uh, rounds in about two days. And I try to avoid holidays and weekends, and even late evening. Uh, and it is a holiday, tomorrow. It's the 4th of July tomorrow, so you're probably seeing this around mid-July, who knows when. Unless I get a huge win here, and then I'll edit this first. But I don't, it doesn't look like this. Okay, okay, we got it, see? I gave it a little doubt, and it gave me a little confidence by giving us six hats. So let's see what we're gonna do. You know how this works? We have straw hats. We need to turn the straws into wood. We need hats to do that. And the wood's in the mansion. Oh, the, okay. That's one hat and two spins. Okay. We need three to get a respin. And you really do need to get the respins to give you enough legs to get in there. Oh, come on. This and one more spin. Okay. We gotta give us a mansion here. You know? This is not that good. We have all straw. We have one wood. Six dollars per spin. What, you know, how much could this be? I'm not going to do the math trying to figure out. I know some people say, oh, I'm going to get an estimate this per straw, this per wood, this per mansion. I don't know. We'll just wait and see. Okay, 10 cent denomination. So that is a whopping $31. Now we're going to add to that $9. $40.05, or 50 cents, $42.90 with the line pay. Okay, let's do some backup spins. Might have to do a denomination change here. By the way, I didn't say it, it's, I forgot. The 10 cent denomination, many is at 100, minors at 500, and Oops, I just hit the camera. I'm getting ready to make a move toward the machine. Okay, let's go from 10 cents. Oh, 10 cents is the maximum here. So let's now go to a dollar, or excuse me, $12. Sorry, my mind's moving a little slow here. Okay, I'm gonna get back here now. Here's what I'm gonna, oh, look, there's that golden buzz saw. Okay, I'm gonna stand back here for a moment. Okay, we're about halfway through our bank roll. We have doubled our bet from $6 to $12. We got one bonus, which is really kind of, you know, uh, it kind of spells out what kind of trip we've had this time, which is mean we can get some bonuses. They're just not that good. I have had two hand paid, but it took me a lot to get there. 
Okay, $12, that was a push. Come on, buzz. I, you know, I don't know if I've ever had the golden buzz on. I've played this a bunch of times. But it would be nice to get, you know, full screen and then go to mansions and then get lots of hats. You know, get lots of respins. But, you know, when you get to the bonus round, the respins are the name of the game. That's when you get three hats. And, you know, it's like a free spin. The spin doesn't count, you get to spin again. Okay, nope, triple notice here. Three yet. Okay, Sheena, I'm getting woken up. You need to wake up. I think we time for a random to come up. Is it going to be Coyote? Or is it going to be the wolf's tail? Or the wolf? I guess that is the wolf. Is the coyote going, Arr! or is that a wolf? I don't know, let me know. I guess it's a wolf, because that's the whole thing. You know, it's the three little pigs and a big bad wolf, but I'm sure you knew that. In terms of three little pigs, you know, you see the, the one on the upper left, that's a lazy pig of the three little pigs. That's the lowest payer. In the middle there, you see with carrying the axe, that's a working pig. I like to call him a vocational school piggy because he's got a job. No student loan debt. He's not relying on taxpayers to bail him out. So I like those guys. And then you had the executive pigs who are flashing right there, or also known as the peak e-banker. You know, getting a full screen of those really is a good payoff. Okay, let's get something good here. Let's get the bus saw bonus, but not the mini bonus. By the way, they, on here, the maximum mini is at $100 because uh, it's only a 10 cent machine. Come on, one more. Oh, look, they give us two and two. I don't know. Oh, you know, I've had such good luck with some of the Huff and more puff machines. Okay, we have our friends, the Working Piggies. For $81, that gives us a bit of ammo. Let's try to do it full screen next time. Let's get back to work. Okay, we have tape measures. Of course, the Wolves are Wild, 36. Oh, you waking up, machine? Have you had your morning coffee? It's, 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 it, right now, it's like 7.43 in the morning. Not like 7.43, it is 7.43 in the morning. Come on, bonus, wake me up. Let's wake you up and me up simultaneously. Liking me. And you know, right now my big debate is do I put more money in this machine? And I don't think I want to. Okay, here we go. You know, I didn't get lucky on any weight savers last night. And okay, let's see. Be lucky, please. Nope. Okay, oh, well, let's see. How much should we get here? Oh, okay, we got $36 off of that. That's going to give us three more spins. Maybe that was a lucky spin. Let's see. Did it generate enough to get us a bonus? Come on, buzz, buzz, buzz! Oh, there's that golden buzz saw. Wouldn't that have been wonderful? Okay, last chance for romance. Okay, 360. It, we're not gonna get it, but let's try it. Nope, we didn't get it, okay. As I just said many times, you know, I'd love to tell you, hey, that was a great round. We got a bonus, we got a hand pay. We didn't. Gambling is a risky activity. I put a $1,000 machine, I tried it at $6, I tried it at 12 it just didn't pay off today. So we're going to go on and move over to another machine. I don't know which one I'm going to play next. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and all that fun stuff. That's it for now. I'm the Gadget Guru Andy Parr. Have a great day, and thank you for watching.